Hey everybody, Marty Bostic here. I am the product creator of Ranking Raptor, and it just went live today, September 27th. And I wanted to spend a few minutes going through the product and, and letting you guys get a deeper look now that it's launched, let you see behind the scenes of some of the the other training and some of the things behind the, the upgrades. I've seen a few product reviews out here. Some of them are really good and I appreciate that. And I um, I wanted to dive in a little bit more and help you guys understand what this course is about and what it's not. So I'm gonna go ahead and start with what it's not. What it's not is the run of the mill rehashed bullshit that's out there like, like a lot of them. So I see a ton of them that's the standard gold standard launch jacking approach to, to doing things to get out there and put product reviews out there, cookie cutter commission gorilla pages and, and the typical stuff. Some of them are really good. Some folks do a, a good job of those, <clears throat> but we're going to talk about long-term strategy, long-term ranking and where it matters inside of YouTube is that that suggested and related videos that you see in the side strip that shows up over there. Well, when you get over there, when you go look at a video, let's just go pick one real quick. Let's um, <clears throat> let's just go pick one of these videos from a uh, from Rank Snap. So here's a Jonah Armstrong's review of Rank Snap. I'm gonna pause it, and over to the right over here, you get related suggested videos. Okay, so up next is his next one that's in the loop there. But then you got everything from George Carlin to the billionaires talking to Robert Kiyosaki to Irish music sessions because I happen I have an interest in that. <clears throat> if you're logged in to a YouTube account, then you get the option there of being able to uh, find the things that you like and you favorite and you add to your playlist and all those types of things. But you can also optimize your videos where you start appearing over here on the side. So notice there's uh, some other related products and similar things that are showing up over here. Well, the goal behind Ranking Raptor is to teach you fundamental. I, you know, I, I built it where the primary product, the main training product, shows you the manual way to, to literally start with a, <clears throat> a bare channel, a naked channel, build it from the ground up, optimize it, brand it, put trailer videos on it, keyword it, do all those things you need to be doing to, to build a channel out. And after that, the process is <clears throat> Getting that strong foundation built and then finding out who your competitors are that you're trying to, to go against and outrank. YouTube searches are great where you, you get over here, like the one that I'm using as an, an example inside of the training course is for alternative control panels to, to cPanel. So I do a lot of web hosting. I, I manage a lot of dedicated servers. cPanel went up on their prices, so I've been building out a channel around alternative control panels ultimately that will be a blog built out on the other end of that that I'll monetize and make money off of hosting affiliate offers and some other good stuff. So, you know, there's there's keywords like these where you can see, here's the guy at the top right now, the top of the heap. Here's me, I shift around like the cPanel alternatives is the one that we're building out in the example. I teach you inside of that how to build it out where you've got a branded keyworded channel. If you're not a subscriber of the channel, then you would see a trailer video, all the introduction stuff. Handful of videos on here. I'm going to be adding some more as I uh, uh, build out some examples for students of the course. <clears throat> Putting a, a header up here that will work regardless if you're on a mobile phone, if you're on a desktop, if you're on a, an iPad, whatever the case may be. But learning how to leverage playlists and rank those, do all those things, I actually teach you how to do that the manual way inside of here. And um, these are, of course, modules. Some of these have just one video, some have multiple. So, um, like this one right here, I've got a handful of video lessons inside of here. And inside of one of those, here we talk about playlists. So, I, I let you look over my shoulder on every one of these and I show you how that works. And you can traverse through to the next lesson and the next lesson. Everything you see is done with free tools, uh, free solutions, and um, there's a couple that have some trials in there, but you can you can choose to use those or not. But the idea was to build a fundamentals course where you understand the right way to go about researching, 
finding those gaps and opportunities from your competition, using some of those same weaknesses against them and ranking and outranking them and sticking in those suggested videos over there because that's where the bulk of your traffic long term is going to come from. Now, a lot of folks look for the immediate instant gratification. I call them instant gratification junkies where if they can't get results in 10 minutes, then they say screw it and they move on. That's not what this course is. Don't don't get it if that's what you're thinking it is because what I show you takes a couple of weeks at times. I've seen it take as much as a month before the videos that I've optimized start sticking in those suggested video spots. But the cool thing about that is once you're there, for the most part, you stay there. I've got videos that have been there for years for some other, some other things that I've done. And it's not like the organic search results because those look different depending on what YouTube data center you come from. Probably didn't know that. But every YouTube data center, every Google data center, gives people an optimal experience for their local viewing area and sometimes their indexes don't quite match and what I do is I, I show you inside of there how to, to overcome some of that and um, when you get out here looking for these things you're gonna get some juice out of this you're gonna get some some low-hanging fruit where you do appear like this one's mine this one's mine um, you know this guy right here web hosting I pushed him out of the way. He was up above me. Then I got this other guy over here that's just kind of here by default. So what I'm doing is I'm taking his research and I'm shoving him out of the way where I might not beat him in the normal search, but the goal is over a few weeks, I will start to appear over here on the right in the suggested videos. That's, that's the plan. So you don't get a stick rate on every video. You don't get results with every video, but you have to do more and more and more of them. By the time I'm done, I'll probably have anywhere from 30 to 50 videos in this channel that I'm building out, and that will be an established authoritative presence where, where it's getting the traction that I need. Now, you've probably heard people talk about doing comments on videos and posting links in videos. Not the way to do it, just, just scattershot like that. So if you get the upgrades, you know, I've got two upgrades laid out for you get a drink make sure our recording still going Hang on one second yep it is um you pick up the first upgrade the automating your research upgrade what I start to do is show you how I use third-party tool to automate or semi-automate a huge portion of this this whole process because to do it manually I'll tell you guys when I made this part of the course right here the the foundational piece of it it absolutely sucked i can't tell you how big of a pain in the ass it was to manually build a channel from the ground up without the help of automation but i wanted to do it so you can see that you can do it you actually can if you're on a budget you can't afford the tools do the manual route you can still do it but it takes you a whole lot longer and there's a lot of manual work involved to make that happen so I broke this up into two upgrades. You have an automating your research upgrade, and that's what this one is that you see here. I go through an overview in each of these. Um, I use Cliff Kerrigan's Locus Wear Suite of tools. The reason I use his tools because they freaking work, and nobody else has any like them. You'll see some other knockoffs and some copycats out there, but he's the real deal. He is the real deal, and the tools that he creates work. I've, uh, I've been a beta tester of them for quite some time. And I've gotten to see some some really amazing stuff that he's put together. Basically, anything you can think of you can do manually, he's found a way to automate. So there is a monthly subscription to the Locust Wear suite of tools. There's varying subscription prices. I break that down for you to look at here. Now, of course, the prices are subject to change like anything else, but it's been fairly consistent. Um, you can actually get a remote VPS or three remote VPSs, depending on the subscription level you go with where you've got dedicated machines out there that you can run your tools on like you see right here I've got my tools running on these remote machines and they're not tying up my machine I can walk away and go do something else I can use my computer for something else and these are working for me in the background okay so the tools that are in place out here are pretty daggum amazing and I walk through the whole thing I actually put together mind map to show you what each tool is 
to walk through and illustrate how each tool is used, how we, we go from building a channel authority to assembling a video, researching our competition, all of the things that I talk about in those videos I have here. Now, I'm gonna show you a couple of these tools behind the scenes, just so you know I'm not full of crap. Um, let's start with automatically building my channel authority. So before I started this video, I kicked off a project here for this one, and I teach you how to use this as well. This is just one of his tools, it's called Tube Authority Commander. So the way I use this is I use spin syntax. I actually wrote in human spun a comment so they, they make sense. And what happens is you choose your target keyword that you're going after, you put in settings, randomization settings, and it will not let you post more than five comments per day. It, it'll go ahead and, and roll around the next day and do another five, but it will not let you exceed the red flag mark, basically, so you stay under the radar. It, it helps you behave and stay under the radar the way you need to. Um, it's automatically, as you can see here, since the time we started going through this video, it's found two YouTube videos with some authority in them, or some beginning authority, and it went out and it put a comment on both of those. And it spun a version of this that you see here. And then the um, it used the videos it found using the exact keyword search that I had here, the one that I specified here. Literally, I don't have to do anything with this unless I wanna switch up which keyword I'm going after or I wanna throw a, a random list of keywords up here. There's probably five to 700 variations of this human spun piece of text right here that will automatically get used to um, uh, to create the random comments. And I did it in a very generic manner where I'm talking about the subject matter. I'm not putting a link in there, okay? So I'm not showing people links. I'm not raising the flags. You're probably wondering why in the hell would I leave a comment out there for something like this and I'm not putting my link out. It's not the goal. The goal is to find relevant, YouTube channels and videos that it will automatically, you see it's telling you, you know, what it just did real quick. It's looking for videos that match your keyword terms. It finds ones with some authority in it. It leaves a comment, subscribes, does some thumbs up, just random things. And what happens is there's, there's a natural reciprocation where YouTube goes out there and they look at those videos and they go, oh, here's a guy that's engaging with other videos and other channel owners. The engagement is what YouTube pays attention to. It's, it's not the BS spam stuff you got out here. They pay attention to who's actually engaging. So when they see your channel, which I have the, the login credentials for my channel plugged in here, it's logging in as that YouTube user and doing those actions. So what happens is my channel over here that's, that's relatively new, okay, the one called cPanel Alternatives, it's starting to build you know, we got a couple subscribers in here. One of these is mine, but the other one is not. But it's starting to build some authority. It'll start to get some, some increased authority over time in a natural way. And what will happen is if you'll, if you'll keep tools like these going and you do them proper, then there's another comment we got now. So if you'll do that proper, what will happen is your channel will start to rise up in the, the rank power index. That's a term that, that Cliff Kerrigan came up to, came up with, the guy that created Locust Weird. That rank power index looks at Moz API calls where it goes out there and it looks up the domain authority and page authority and determines the ones that it finds in here, which ones have some clout, which ones have more. Right now, this 55 is all uh, just kind of base level authority but it's totally relevant to what my keyword is. So what will happen is over time, your channel will start to improve in its authority. And as you add videos in there, have you ever wondered why when you put a video in here, little squatters like this dude right here land at the top? Well, it's because they are more relevant and they've got a little bit more clout and a little bit more juice in there. So here's 80. Yeah, it's got some likes, he's got some comments and dislikes, but he's got some presence out here, which I don't, so I have to work my way up through here. And as I become more relevant and I start to show up in the index there and I move up through it, then I start to stand out and stick more. So you know, one of the reasons some of these guys just hang in there is because they've got a pretty good presence. So it's it's a natural thing to use these tools and, and 
have them assist you in what you're doing. So I'm not going to spend a long time on this. I want to jump back over here for just a minute. Let's talk about some of the other things that are inside of this particular upgrade. So the research one, research one, I show you how to use each of the tools and how I go about the research using the mind map. I, I navigate through the mind map and show you each area that we're talking about. So I look, show you how to use the tools to find the keyword opportunities, how to find questions that people actually ask. So like the um, uh, keyword question commander is one of the tools. It would take you forever to go find this shit. It, it really would. So here's an output from one of the keyword question commander projects that I ran. So the tool is pretty straightforward. I mean, it's a very simple looking tool. You put a keyword or keywords in here, give it a project name, click go. And when it's done, you'll end up with an output like this where you see questions that were found on Google, but notice they don't have a keyword next to them until that I, it finds one that this specific keyword around the keywords that I was targeting it finds that and says, hey, here's a question of how do I know what version of WHM I have? That's an actual question from somebody looking for that answer. So what we do is we leverage those questions and those titles when we assemble our videos and we make it very, very targeted around what people are actually asking, but we make the root keyword that we're targeting cPanel alternative. And over here, does WordPress cost money? cPanel alternatives, open source, happen to be the keyword that was used for that. And you can see where these were assembled. And now I've got a list of questions that are extremely targeted. I know what to go after. And down below here, it gives me kind of the raw text list of all my keywords I chose and then the questions that it found. So very simple. That's just one tool of about 40 that are in your control panel. So inside of the Locusware control panel where these tools are buried, you get access to all the tools for that one subscription. So when you, you get that set up, you don't have to buy each of these tools individually. They are all included in your control panel and you can install them. They are Windows based. So that's why I do recommend people going with the, um, the subscription level that'll give you a remote VPS, a Windows VPS. And that's language commander. Sorry, I lost the wrong one. Um, but any of these tools that are inside that control panel, you can do one click installs of them. You get them over here on the desktop. You can see under affiliate marketing, pile of tools there, domain tools. There's one that's all encompassing expired domain tool. That's just fantastic. These used to be individual tools, but they're now inside of one. Some email marketing tools, some local marketing tools. There's the video marketing tools. And I go through a huge portion of these inside of this course. So the first upgrade consists of going through the research tool. The second upgrade consists of using the tube authority commander um, tools to actually create videos, actually spin and do mass video creation. So some of those tools that are in place there can actually create those, those particular um, Sorry, my Alexa device is going. Alexa, cancel. Sorry. So at the end of the day, the upgrades, the first upgrade covers all the research tools. The second upgrade covers the actual automation tools that I have running that do a lot of this heavy lifting for me, that assemble videos, that, that do the, the automatic authority building on the channel like you see right here. So I break those down inside the second. So. I put this video together today for you so it answers some of your questions out of the box before you buy it. And as another incentive um, in the description of this video, I've also put a coupon code for you that you can use to get, uh, I believe I said it at $5 off. So you can use that at checkout and you can get $5 off your purchase, but that's good for the next 24 hours. But guys, I, I hope this is helpful. If you got any questions, feel free to, uh, to contact me. You can reach me on Warrior Plus. You can, um, you can reach me in, uh, in Discord. You can find me. You can email me. I, I make all my contact details available inside of YouTube. You can actually comment there and, um, and reach out to me, and I'll contact you. So I hope this is helpful. Click on the link below to go get your copy of Ranking Raptor today. 
I hope it helps you and I hope you can devour that competition using this research. Take care.